Hi, I'm Dave Nguyen, and in this episode, we're going to talk about a famous science blunder. So back in the 1950s and 60s, a drug called thalidomide was given to pregnant women in order to ease symptoms of morning sickness. The problem was that thalidomide caused birth defects in about 10,000 babies. The birth defects included limbs that never grew out or hands and feet that were misshapen. The problem was that scientists never tested thalidomide on pregnant animals. It turns out that thalidomide is toxic in humans but not in mice because humans have a particular liver enzyme that is produced when we are embryos. But in mice, this enzyme is not produced while they are embryos. And it's this enzyme that turns thalidomide into a dangerous chemical that causes birth defects. In a recent study, scientists introduced the human enzyme into mice and then grew mouse embryos in a petri dish. In this experiment, they were able to show that indeed, even in mice, thalidomide causes malformations in limb development. Previous studies using chick embryos showed that 24 hours of treatment with thalidomide reduced the amount of blood vessels that were supposed to form in the limbs of embryonic chickens. However, chickens are not mammals, which is why this new study in mice is novel and adds another piece to the puzzle of understanding how thalidomide causes birth defects.